MP for Bill as well as uh, Brecken and Radnish. And uh, it's a great pleasure. And it's a great pleasure to uh, welcome so many of you here today into this wonderful constituency and at this uh, incredibly important memorial. Uh, we meet here always at this time of year when the days are getting shorter, when the weather is getting more bleak, uh, when our spirits are a little bit low, I guess, uh, at this time of year. Uh, but we come here so that we can be replenished with that energy and vigour that uh, Llewellyn uh, so much in, uh, encapsulated and the stories about him tell us. Um, I think every year I come here, uh, unfortunately I wasn't here last year, there seem to be more and more people here and I think uh, we might need a bigger mice, a bigger field very shortly in order uh, that everybody who wants to come here uh, can come. Uh, uh, okay. Um, now, I, as I, I wasn't here last year, and uh, I'm sure a tribute was paid to Richard Lindsay, who was such a, a wonderful supporter of this event, uh, and he was absolutely loyal uh, to it and knew the significance of it. And I just pay my tribute to him because he introduced me to this, and I hope in some way that I can carry on his uh, his work. You know. This memorial is here, it's in one place in Wales, but that's not the important thing. This is symbolic, uh, but the important thing is that the work and the vision that uh, Llewellyn had is carried on throughout Wales, and that has been passed down from generation uh, to generation. And, you know, we shouldn't be ashamed of saying that we actually belong to a generation that has seen huge cons constitutional change in Wales. We are riding almost in a constitutional uh, uh, swing, a, a, a roller coaster of constitutional change. And only this year, of course, we've had the referendum that's brought extra powers from the, for the Assembly to give them the same standing over the issues in which they've got control that other parliaments have uh, throughout the uh, United Kingdom and, and indeed throughout Europe, as, uh, as, as was said earlier. And that's not all. That's not all. We are now participating in a consultation that, so the Assembly can raise its own funds. And that's so important. You've got to be responsible as a politician. You've got to be responsible not only for how you spend money, but how you raise money as well. And that brings greater maturity. And so we're all participating in that. And I find that hugely and very, very uh, exciting as well. Uh, we heard today, you know, that uh, Llewellyn had all the virtues of his grandfather and none of the vices. What we need to do is to ensure that we build upon those virtues that Llewellyn so admirably uh, uh, demonstrated, of bringing people together. You know, I think we'll look back and when they write the history of the last two days, it'll be seen that the people who have strength are the people who bring people together and the people who are weak are the people who stand aside and break up things that have proved to be worthwhile. We in Wales and people in small nations throughout Europe, throughout the world indeed, have a real purpose in bringing people together. And when we come here every year at this time of year, we rekindle that enthusiasm and that determination to be a bringer together of people, to make sure that we work together and we don't break apart because breaking apart is weakness, coming together is strength. And that's what Llewellyn tells us. Jochen Raoul Roger, thank you very much indeed. I'd like to call upon another regular supporter of this event, and that's Ko Kochian Cardiz. Can you put your hands together and keep warm?